at Amelia Island 2020. When you hear the phrase mid-engine Corvette, chances are that the image of a C8 Corvette, the Corvette that's making 2020 headlines, pops into your head. But the 2020 Corvette is not the only mid-engine Corvette to ever exist. So a lot of people don't know, but the C8 Corvette is not the first mid-engine Corvette. There were a couple prototypes that weren't officially released. Really cool looking cars. One of them actually had a rotary engine. So check these out. Yeah, they call this the Wankelvet. This is insane because this is one of the first mid-engine Corvettes and it's a rotary engine. Apparently there's only 16 moving parts in this engine. And obviously a rotary engine is perfect for a mid-engine car because it's so compact and it spits mad flames. Look at the look at the back of this thing. Look how it slants down, Sam. <laughs> it's the AeroVet. See the whole quad central exhaust pipe thing wasn't a C7 specific thing. Transverse mounted. There's like an apex. Can you believe this is the Corvette? <laughs> This looks like a, a, a Lamborghini Miura. Oh man, it's aluminum. Unreal. The back looks like the front. This is insane. So coming from a long line of mid-engine Corvette prototypes, the CER V3 was General Motors' latest attempt towards achieving that goal of mid-engine Corvettes. Inspiration for the car's design came from the Corvette Indy, which was revealed in 1986, but the CER V3 went a step further by addressing the real-world issues like drivability and safety. The body, designed by Jerry Palmer's team in Chevy 3 Studio, was a combo of carbon fiber, Kevlar, and aluminum honeycomb. With a drag coat Efficient of 0.277. The car had a calculated top speed of 225 miles per hour. Insane. It featured full-time four-wheel drive and active suspension while influencing the roofline of the C5 Corvette. Hey look, it's Wayne Carini of Chasing Classic Cars. They're just doing their thing. Yeah. But hey, you saw it first on Not So Handy Car Guy. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. I like that. Good advertising. Thanks.